If you want to build the best team in Madden and need some coins, make sure to check out my sponsor AOA for the cheapest, most reliable coins in Madden 22 and use code NOBLE at checkout for 3% discount. Link is in the description. What's up today my fellow Madden soldiers? So what I'm going to be explaining to you guys right now is how I go about getting all my coins and this method that I'm going to show you guys right now which is not something that you know it takes a lot to really figure out it's something that's very easy when it comes to figuring out and that is basically grinding and it's guaranteed coins you don't have to sit there and take risks you don't have to sit there and go and snipe or whatever, whatever the case may be but i want to honestly continue to reassure you guys that grinding is the easiest way to make coins and i'm going to show you guys right now because i got tons of coin quick sells that i actually got from grinding and then we're going to go ahead and i'm going to quick sell those at the end but let me go ahead and explain to you guys i don't know if you guys like to play solo battles i don't know what it is the pending rewards i didn't uh okay so i already got that so let me back out because i haven't played it yet for this week so i, I don't like that it does that we it, it like basically makes you back out to basically refresh it but it is what it is maybe it's a good thing but anyways this is the solo battles right here i play all these on legend and I get legend week every week. I don't try to get number one, top 100 and so forth. If you want to go ahead, but I'm not gonna do that. My main thing is getting legend and I get my coins every week from this. So this is one of the methods that I use in order for me to get my coins and not just that, the players. The only thing I don't like about it is the packs like the midfields, the touchdown and stuff like that. They're not guaranteeing you a coin no more. I mean, you don't get no coin quick sales no more. And I don't like that because unless you're gonna give me a good card i don't care I, I don't care i don't care about the packs like i want a coin quick sell and that's the only thing i like about it but i still grind it because to me it's still worth it and you can also still pull something glitchy from those packs and what i do with those packs is i allow my players just to stack up what you're gonna see right now i got i got tons of items in my binder and that's another reason why i need to do this video because a lot of them are coming from my coin quick sells so i want to make sure i show you guys that so once I do it, like I said, I haven't grinded this week, but I always get Legend. And I did a video on that, on how to get Legend, just to let you guys know that. So if you guys want to check it out, go ahead and check my videos out. I have one on how to get Legend in Solo Battles, if you guys want to know. You don't have to have a stack team. I got Legend with like, what, an 83 overall on the No Money Spin Team account a while back. Yeah, my team right now is a 90, and I will use my 90 overall to, in order to do it. But... I'm going to be honest, I don't know what's going on, but when I did it with my 82, 83 overall, I, I really didn't tell much of a difference. If anything, I felt that it, it got a little easier at times on my 82, 83 overall. I know that sounds kind of funny, but it was it's actually the truth. So I really didn't tell a difference. It's actually having certain positions that really help you out. You don't have to have a stacked team, but you need certain positions filled and certain budget beasts in order for you to, you know, to help you win. And a big one is speed. Make sure you have good speed. And that would really help you out when it comes to the solo battles. That's the main thing I could tell you. If find budget beasts with good speed and they will help you out. Put them at key positions like wide receiver, your safeties, you know, your cornerback, stuff like that, to where these guys just can't go on you and score and have good fast linebackers so you can rush the QB in order and get sacks all the time. Okay. So you know you guys already know another solos is another one. Whenever whenever there's new promos and stuff out, play all your solos, play everything get your coins quick sell quick sell the cars you don't need for training or sell them for coins if you could if they're sellable and so forth so that's another one and they just continue to stack up but a big one the one besides solo battles my biggest one is head to head and that is where i get all my coins at the only thing i do not like about head to head right now is the fact let me see where we at right here so we got a new season now you see right here we're all star I'm too, uh, I'm too close to getting Legend. I have got Legend before, but it, it goes up and down. It, it, you know, you go up and down. But you see right there, I've been grinding. I jumped on it, and this was just one night. I was I, I was winning back to back. I have, a, I have a winning streak. If I'm feeling it, I'm focused, my, my mind's clear, and I can just relax, I can win. But if I'm just frustrated, like I just want to hurry up and win, I'm not going to lie. I usually quit out. I usually do things like that, and it messes up my my status and so forth but as long as i'm patient i win a lot of my games i win most of my games 
So, and I, and I do it with my Cowboy theme team. The reason I do it with my Cowboy theme team is because it's a win-win. I'm making my coins and I'm actually making videos for you guys so you guys can see when it comes to the Cowboy theme team because you guys like watching that team. So that's what I'm doing. I'm not even using my 90 overall when it comes to head-to-head. -to -head. I'm using my Dallas Cowboy theme team and that's how I, that's how I got All-Star. I did it with my Cowboy theme team. I do not use my 90 overall to go online. Maybe once in a while to, to, to go ahead and just do uh, use a different team. But my Cowboy theme team is what got me to All-Star right now. That is a fact. And I did it in one night. I was all the way down to Pro. And I went all the way up to um, All-Star. So they give you a lot more coins, I will say. But what I don't like is they don't have trophies no more. The trophies was very pivotal because you could trade those trophies for players. You could trade those trophies for more coins. It just made it, it made your grinding a lot more better. So that's what I will say that I don't like. But they do kind of kind of offer a little bit more coins when it comes to grinding now. But they want you to play head to head. That's what I do. That's why I do all my grinding now, and that's how I get most of my coins. I won't say all of them, but most of my coins because. You're guaranteed, as long as you win, you're gonna get your coins, they stack up. If you're getting close to 4K for for winning a game, guess what? Three games, that's already 12K. That stacks up fast. And then after you complete a series, like say for instance, you won six game, you didn't get to win your seventh game, so you know it restarts over. Some of those, I got like 10K, 9K, 8K, depending on what series I was at. So I'm gonna show you guys right, right now. We're gonna go ahead and quick sell them. And I'm going to show you where some of the coins I got from. I don't remember all of them. They're from head to head, but I don't know what like, what's it like this 15K right here. This was actually for getting all-star on head to head. So I got to 15K. Let's see what else. Before I actually quick this 9K was, was, I think I was like going from like veteran to something else, but whatever it was, I basically went up in status. They gave me the 9K. Even when you get demoted, you get coins. This 25k honestly was from daily objectives. I do remember that. That got this 25k from daily objectives. This 59k and 500 is from solo battles. Just to let you guys know that. 7k, same thing head to head. Demoted or promoted, whatever one it was, I don't remember. So I thought I had another one for like 10k. That 7k right there. I don't have a 10k one, it's 9k. I guess not. Maybe I sold it and didn't realize it. You even get something for losing. You see, I got one with like 390K. I mean, 390 coins or 400 coins up there for losing. Oh, so some of these games are so frustrating. Oh, that was so frustrating. So you're going to see how much right now I made. Okay, so that's all of them. See that? And that's just from grinding. Now, I will say all together in a week because I had to play solo battles and everything else. I say in a week. We're going to give it a week. 226k coins just from grinding and that online one was one day where i grinded solo battles and online tons of coins this is where oh okay okay and daily objectives so that's where i was like well how are you gonna get that i have daily objectives so that's another thing too day doing your daily objectives as you can see right there i got 25k quick sell which you're not gonna get all the time but you're still gonna be getting quick sells every day and that adds up daily objectives solo battles online grinding i'll say i'll give it a week just to be modest this isn't a week 226k sometimes i don't always get sometimes i'll depending on what mood and mood i'm in and i go grind i'll get i'll say about 150k 200 200k 150k 200k i got a little bit more there but i'll say about 150k you know just just to be a little bit more modest with it because some of those quick sells every day from the daily objectives you're not always gonna get 25k 10k but you might hit here and there and get get a good amount of coins just to let you guys know so that's not guaranteed but the grinding solo battles you're guaranteed a certain amount of coins daily objectives you're not it fluctuates so i'll say about a 150k 200k and you only have to grind that much to set aside set time aside to do it and you know Make sure you have your time management right and get it done. And like I say, you don't have to do it that much. I don't. I'm not sitting here just grinding online all day long. Nah, that was just one night. I did my solo battles, daily objectives, and I got that in a week. 
so I'm happy I already got 800k coins so I'm happy with that I say this video just to let you guys know like I said if you're not about to grind this video went for you I'm about to grind I need guaranteed coins all this sniping all that, I don't I don't do all that just it takes too long and all that sniping everything that I'm over here trying to do I could be online playing the game and just guaranteeing me coins instead of hoping that I'm gonna hit the jackpot so anyways there it is there if you guys like seeing what you seen drop a like on the video if you guys need sub sub to the channel there will be more great amazing content coming your way thank you guys all for tuning in